all three runners safely arrived down at the start. Running up process will shortly commence. Don't forget if you turn to page 11 of today's race cards, your chance to win some stunning old Melanie jewellery. Just following that form there and post it into the competition box near the weighing room. We'll be drawing the winners out after race number six. Please do visit the Morecambe Marne hospitality tent as well on the grandstand lawn. There's plenty of uh, racing memorabilia being sold near the uh, winner's enclosure as well. Running up process has begun. Warud into stall one. Savar into stall three. And Shake Rock into stall number two. The Savar Juvenile Stakes all in, and they're off and racing. Six furlongs in front of them, and Shake Rock breaking out fairly smartly in the centre, with uh, just pre being preceded now by Savar as they come to the end of the first furlong. Warud is last of the trio as they come to the end of the first furlong. Savar, red sleeves and cap against the rail. Shake Rock in the black jacket, just hanging a little bit towards the outside. In the green cap, Warud is racing back in third. Coming to the end of the first quarter mile, and Shake Rock in the hands of Steve Harrison has gone to the front. So the favourite leads as they go across the intersection and approach halfway. Shake Rock just edging over to the inside running grail. Warud on the outside in the green cap. She's coming up quite powerfully on the outside to draw alongside Shake Rock as they pass halfway. They're readily drawing clear of Savar, so they make the run down to the final two furlongs. Warud being held together out in the centre. Shake Rock coming under a strong drive to the near side, and Warud has edged to the front. So they make the run down towards the final furlong. Warud is the leader. Shake Rock just hanging out into the centre. Still about a length and a half behind. Savar is racing back in third. Down to the final furlong. Warud on the left, clear by two lengths from Shake Rock, who might end up over on the far side. Running Grail continuing to hang. A half furlong left to travel. Warud is the leader. Three to four lengths clear. And the outsider of the trio will get her nose in front. She's off the mark at the second attempt. Warud, she looks pretty useful as well. She beat Shake Rock into second. And Savar last of the trio. First number three, second number one, and third number two.